More coronavirus vaccines for our frontline workers and first responders. Good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining us. I'm Chris Gutierrez. And I'm Lauren Freeman. Dominique is off tonight. A big day for the Houston area. 3,000 doses reaching Harris County Public Health, 3,000 received by the City of Houston's Health Department, and 3,000 for Houston firefighters and paramedics. Only on two tonight, Channel 2's Roseanne Aragon just spoke with firefighters in charge of rolling out the vaccination process. So, Roseanne, what what does this mean for firefighters? Well, these firefighters have been working extremely long hours. In fact, the two that I spoke with are at work right now. They say this vaccine will help alleviate the stress and the newest doses will be administered as soon as next week. In a time of need, firefighters are there. I love my job and I would like to do this job for another 20 more years. Houston firefighters answering the call despite the risks. We've had 465 firefighters test positive for coronavirus and we sadly we've had three fatalities. And just today, we, um, we were informed that, that we have another firefighter in the emergency room. But now, alongside the city of Houston and the Harris County Health Department, Houston firefighters also received 3,000 doses of the Moderna vaccine. Chief Sam Pena hopes to give the entire department the option to be vaccinated by the end of January. It really affects the respiratory system. So for us as firemen, we have to be able to breathe. So... This has been a really tough time for us. We're walking into people's homes every day, and it's important for us to be uh, good examples. Volunteering to lead the effort is Captain David Rieger. My wife is, is in healthcare too, and having both of us vaccinated and just having a little bit of relief, it allows you to come home with a lighter heart and an easier mind. He says the new vaccines will be rolled out as soon as next week. The priority will be those with direct contact with people in the field and then support teams. More than 60% of Houston firefighters showed an interest in getting this. Senior Captain Joshua Vogel is getting his suit, and he says he can't wait. Now, both of those firefighters' wives are health care heroes, so they say getting this vaccine will provide their family some comfort. For now, reporting live from Fire Station 33, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC, Channel 2 News.